If you're hunting for a graphics card that promises cutting-edge AI enhancements and robust gaming performance with an extra splash of style, the PNY NVIDIA GeForce RTX 5070 might just catch your eye. But how well does it truly stack up when you dive beyond the specs and marketing buzz? Stick around as we unpack the real strengths and the compromises of this latest GPU contender. I'm Brian from the Inspect Aspect, where we explore the tech that powers your gaming and creative worlds with honesty and insight. Today, we're looking at the PNY NVIDIA GeForce RTX 5070 12 GB ARGB overclocked triple fan graphics card. This card brings some exciting next-gen features like DLSS4, PCIe 5.0 support, and eye-catching Epic X RGB lighting aimed at gamers and creators alike. Let's break down what makes this card stand out and where it might fall short. The first major highlight is the implementation of DLSS4, NVIDIA's latest neural rendering technology. By using AI to boost frame rates, reduce latency, and enhance image quality, it provides smoother gameplay without sacrificing visuals, especially at higher resolutions or demanding settings. For gamers chasing ultra-fluid experiences, this translates to a noticeable improvement in responsiveness and graphical fidelity. Secondly, the card's hardware foundation is built on the fifth-generation Tensor cores, new streaming multiprocessors, and fourth-generation ray tracing cores. This trio represents a significant leap in processing power and efficiency. Ray tracing, in particular, reaches new heights here, delivering more realistic lighting and shadow effects that breathe life into modern titles. Third, PNY's version includes an overclocked factory setting combined with a robust triple fan cooling system housed in a 2.4 slot design. This means the GPU runs cooler and quieter under load, allowing sustained high performance without thermal throttling. The triple fans, along with the enhanced heat sink, provide efficient heat dissipation, which is critical during long gaming sessions or intense creative workloads. Lastly, the Epic X ARGB lighting is more than just an aesthetic bonus. It offers customizable RGB lighting effects synced with your setup, creating an immersive ambiance for your gaming or productivity space. While this won't improve frame rates, it enhances your overall experience with a personal touch, merging style with substance. One notable downside is the physical size of the card. At a 2.4 slot width, it demands a spacious case and good airflow, which might rule it out for smaller builds or systems with limited internal clearance. This can be a challenge for users with compact or minimalist setups who still want cutting edge performance. Another con is that while the card supports PCIe 5.0, many motherboards and CPUs available today don't fully leverage this interface yet. This somewhat bottlenecks the potential bandwidth gains until the ecosystem catches up, which means some users won't see immediate benefits from this feature. Additionally, the power draw of the RTX 5070 is something to consider. Being a high-performance overclocked card with advanced cores, it requires a solid power supply and good power management. Systems with older or marginal PSUs might struggle or face instability, which raises the bar when planning your build or upgrade. Finally, while the RTX 5070 shines in both gaming and creative applications, its sweet spot is more mid to high tier. For ultra enthusiasts chasing 4K at max ray tracing settings, this card may hit limitations without scaling back some settings, especially compared to the higher tier RTX 5080 or flagship models. On the inspect aspect scale, I'm rating the PNY NVIDIA GeForce RTX 5070 a strong, vibrant 7.5. It's a compelling GPU that integrates advanced AI capabilities, solid ray tracing performance, and excellent cooling with an added flair of customizable RGB lighting. It strikes a great balance for gamers and creatives wanting the latest NVIDIA tech without venturing into extreme tiers. However, its physical size, power demands, and partial dependency on emerging PCIe 5.0 ecosystems temper its appeal for some users. If your setup can accommodate its footprint and power needs, and you appreciate next-gen AI enhancements and ray tracing, this card is well worth considering. For those prioritizing compactness or ultimate 4K max settings, exploring other options might be prudent. Don't forget to check the link on your screen and in the description below 
for the best prices and deals available right now. Thanks for watching the Inspect Aspect. See you next time.